uh, we have an interesting question and so for x we have uh, 2x minus 11 uh, root x plus 12 which is equals to 0 so we have to solve for x now let's get started the solution let's write the question first we have uh, 2x minus 11 root x plus 12 which is equals to 0 right is equals to zero then here what you can do you have to add uh, these numbers so we can say uh, 2x plus 12 uh, to be equals to when uh, you add uh, 11 root x both side you are going to have 11 root x to the right side right then here we're going to say 2 x let's say we have uh, uh this is our 2x plus 12 equals 11 root x right in which uh here what you have to do you have to introduce uh squared both side for us to remit uh, this square root which we are having here, right? And here, this is a defined of two squares, so we are going to say it will be uh, 2x plus 12 in the bracket, then 2x plus 12 in the bracket, which is equals to uh, this one, we can separate it by saying uh, z, uh, 11 squared, then multiply by uh, root x squared all right then here what you have to do uh two times the two x times two x you're going to have four x squared then two x times twelve x you're going to have plus twenty four x twelve times two x you're going to have plus twenty four x then twelve times twelve which is a plus c one forty four which is equals to uh, 21 squared we all know that it is 121 then this squared with this root would remain with the x a right then what you have to do you have to correct the like term in which we are going to have uh 4 x squared 24 plus 24 x we are going to have a uh, plus 48 x then when you subtract uh, 121 both sides, you're going to have uh, minus 121x plus 144, which is equals to 0, right? Because here we have, uh, we have crossed this 121 to the other side, right? Then uh, 4x squared then plus... 48 minus uh, 48 x minus 1.1 x you're going to have uh, 73 x plus c uh, 144 right which is equals to zero and now this is a quadratic equation so now let, let me just uh, create a space here Uh, we have this quadratic equation with let's write it here for x squared plus c uh, 73 oh it is in minus here because we are subtracting uh, the bigger number from a smaller number here we are going to have minus c 70 minus 73 uh, plus c here x plus c 1 44 which is equals to zero this is a quadratic equation which you have here so now we can solve uh, this quadratic equation by using uh, the formula this is a b c right then we're going to use the formula which is x equals uh, minus b plus or minus uh, root b squared minus 4ac you divide by 2a right then when you substitute here we have a negative and here there's negative so we're going to have 
73 plus c or minus In the square root we have b squared we have minus 73 squared then minus 4 minus 4 open bracket then where this a we have 4 then uh, c we have uh, 144 right then you divide by uh, 2 times 8 so here we have 2 times 8 right in which uh, x it will be equals to uh, 70 3 plus or minus uh, you can say plus or minus 73 squared 73 squared the answer you're going to get it is uh, 5329 then minus 4 times the Four, which is 16 16 times 144 it will be 2304 then you divide by uh here we have a four yeah four two times the two times this a which is eight so we are going to have eight here in which uh uh five five thousand three hundred and twenty-nine minus twenty three zero four we are going to let's take it here x to be equals to 73 plus or minus uh root t you are going to uh 5329 minus 2304 you are going to have uh three zero then two five right then you divide by Eight in which x it will be equals to uh, seventy seventy three plus or minus the square root of three thousand and twenty five it is fifty five then you divide by eight right then here let's create a space. So now it will be uh, x equals uh, 73. We follow the first sign, which is plus 55. You divide by 8, then O x to be equals to 73 minus 55, right? Then the first x it will be uh, 73 plus 55 you're going to have 128 then you divide by 8 the answer you're going to get it is 16 so this is our first answer then now let's move on to uh this one here x equals this one here here you divide by 8 here yeah. So let me just uh, make a space here because here we have 120, 128, 8 into 128, it is 16. Then we follow the negative sign now, which is uh, 73 minus 55, you divide by, you divide by 8. So now we can take it here x it will be equals to uh, 18 over 4 and if we take uh, this one into this term it will be x uh, 8 18 over not 4 18 because here we have 8 18 over 8 you take it into lowest term uh, 2 into 18 we have 9 2 into 8 we have 4 so these are our values for x so the values of x we have x equals uh, 16 other x it will be equals to 9 over 4 so this answer we can prove it that these answers are correct so we can say let's try to prove now we are doing a proof 
proof we're going to say to where there is uh, x let's start with the 16 so we have uh, 16 then minus 11 then where there is x we have uh, 16 then cross then plus 12 which is a which should be equals to zero so in which are uh, two times 16 we are going to have uh, 32 then minus here we are going to have 11 open bracket uh, root 16 it is a four right then plus 12 which is equals to zero then uh, 32 minus uh, 11 times 4 Four, which is the 44 then plus 12 should be equals to 0 so 32 minus c uh, 144 the answer you are going to get it is minus c 4 plus c 12 which should be equals to 0 so that means that uh, x to be equals to 16 or 5 then we can use uh, this 9 over 4 to prove also. Let's try to create a space here. We can use uh, 9 over. So we can say, we can get this equation, which is uh, 2. Then where is x? We have uh, 9 over 4, right? Then minus 11 root 9 over 4 then plus 4 which is equals to 0 we are just proving that our answers are correct so 2 times 9 which is 18 over 4 then minus uh, 11 then here we are going to have root, root 9 it is 3 and root 4 it is 2 which should be plus 12, which is equals to 0, right? Then here we have 18 over 4, then minus 11 times the 3, which is 83 over 2, then plus 12 should be equals to 0, right? Then we are going to look for a common denominator, which is 4 here. 4 into 4, which is remain with 18, then minus. Uh, 2 into 4 which is the uh, 2 2 times the 3 which is the uh, 66 then plus a uh, 1 into 4 you're going to have 1 into 4 you're going to have 4 4 times the 12 it is the 48 right we should be equals to 0 so now here, uh, if you can see, we can say uh, 48 minus 66. So we can say 66 minus 48. So here we have a 5, 6, which is 8, then 1, right? Here we are going to have minus 18. You are going to have, uh, let me say, uh, let's take it again. Here we, we say it 2 times the 9, which is 18 over 4, uh, then minus uh, 11. Then here we have 3 over 2, that's 12. Then common denominator, which is 4, which is 4 here, right? Then 4 here, 1, 1 times 18, which is 18. 2 into 4, which is 2. 2 times this one, which is uh, minus 66. Then plus 1 into 4, which is 4. 4 times 4, which is 48 right in which uh uh 
66 minus 48, it is 18. So here on top we have 18 minus 18, you divide by 4, it will be equals to 0. Here on top you are going to have uh, 0 divided by 4. Uh, 4 into 0, it is 0. So that means our answer, it is correct where x it is 16 or other x it will be uh, 9 over 4. These are our values for x. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell for the next time you see the new date. And don't forget to share this video with your friends. If you have any question, you can leave your comment below or any question concerning the same question or let me say in the next question uh, section we'll be looking at uh, uh, the past papers for the grade 4 because yesterday we are looking at one of the question for 2022. Thank you.